Thank you for watching Driving Sales News. I'm Dave Martinson. One of the highlights of Driving Sales President's Club 2017 was the most valuable insight competition. This forum gave industry thought leaders a chance to share cutting edge ideas with an elite automotive retail audience. Our follow up to the MBI competition came down to the three winners. Doug Van Sack, Ian Crochank, and Jim Roach spoke to Driving Sales News about what they presented during Driving Sales President's Club 2017. First up, Doug Van Sack, VP of Data Services and Analytics at Autoloop, told Driving Sales News there is a lot of data suggesting dealers find great success when they follow up. We found that uh, when they receive a follow up, they are about 70% more likely to buy than when they don't. And it presented a great opportunity for us to better understand why customers receive follow ups and why they don't to ultimately try to help dealers understand if they're focused on the right people because there's a limited amount of time and it's easy to say, well, they just need to follow up with everyone. The reality is there's limited resources. So we wanted to help dealers understand uh, how to best spend their time so that they could follow up with the right people. Next up, Ian Crochank, VP Sales and Marketing at SpeedShift Media, spoke about how the insight that won him an award was all about website touch points. We explored categorizing all of the different touch points that you can interact with on a vehicle detail page. But we also tracked links, whether it's a link to a, uh, an hours and directions part of the site or a link externally to um, Carfax or something like that. We tracked social sharing, chat, we tracked um, photos and we tracked uh, video and 360 views, that sort of thing. And we put those in different categories. So all of those categories we wanted to see if anything accelerated as a vehicle moved closer to being sold. Finally, Jim Roach said his most valuable insight was modeled after police dispatch services. The salespeople are reactive. They have a reactive DNA. And from a past life uh, in the 80s of working as a sheriff's deputy, I worked around a lot of reactive personalities in the sheriff's department and realized that dispatching was the difference. So we studied 911 systems, uh, LAPD, Harris County Sheriff's Office, and came up with the technology that dispatches the highest triage opportunity to sell a vehicle the same way that a police officer's dispatched and we make sure that it's executed. It works way better for the reactive sales personality of, of the salesperson than does having them do proactive tasks that they, they just generally don't do. That's gonna do it for this look back at the driving sales President's Club 2017 Most Valuable Insight Competition. For more stories about what you might have missed from the conference, be sure to check out drivingsales.com backslash news. For Driving Sales News, I'm Dave Martinson.